Hey, when I was going in this video, I'm going to try to rig a model in Roblox Studio so you can use it for animating and stuff like that. But I was going to show you how to rig the model. I'm not going to do any animation stuff within this tutorial. Just keep that in mind. So I made this little character here. kind of looks like a Roblox noob. So anyways, it has a little face and everything. It's a little goofy looking. But anyways, you want to do the first things first. Is highlight all of this. Just get it all into a group. Just group it. And it'll make it into a model. Okay. So you can name the model whatever you want. I'm not going to change it for this tutorial. I don't really think it matters. So I'm just going to leave it how it is. You can anchor the model if you want to. And then another thing too, I made the face is that I made one torso part. I'm going to split the torso into two parts, a lower and upper torso. I should have done this earlier. It just makes it better for animating and rigging the body parts within the body. So I think it's just better overall to have two torso parts. So I duplicated it and split into two parts here, as you can see. And I'm going to name it now. I'm going to do lower torso for the lower part, obviously, then upper torso for the upper part. So after naming that, we're going to make the humanoid root part, which is really important for your character when you're trying to rig and make joints for your character, animating all that stuff. So duplicate the torso and have it cover the upper and lower torso we're gonna name this humanoid root part you either do it this way or you're gonna fail and never be able to animate ever in your lifetime so anyways go ahead and do that make sure it's transparent as well i kind of forgot to do that and i really didn't notice because it's the same color as the torso i didn't really think about it now the plugin is a rig edit and i'm gonna put the link to the plugin in the description below so you guys can easily add it to Roblox studio and use it so i'm gonna open up the plugin now we're gonna click on the humanoid root part and use a control key so you can select multiple things at once and connect it to the lower torso so there we go now we have a joint or a break between the humanoid root part and the lower torso. Now we're going to do this again, basically. So we're going to select lower torso and upper torso and create a joint. So as you can see, I have a joint between the lower torso and the upper torso. Now we're going to do the multi-select function again with holding down the control key. So we're going to do upper torso, head, left arm, and right arm. So we have that joint in the upper torso. And we're going to do this again, lower torso, right leg, left leg, create a joint. So as you can see, I want to do it like that. And then obviously we're going to do probably the head and the face together. So which I have a mouth, left eye, and a right eye. So I'm going to create a joint that's all together now. So you can see the joints all are between. They're all jointed together. So we pretty much rigged it all together now. Another thing I have to do is select the model and go into property of the model and pivot. And we have to click on the primary part and we have to go in and select it over to the humanoid root part. So the primary part needs to be the humanoid root part within the properties there. So make sure it's set like that. So pretty much your character is now all rigged up and ready to go, which we'll probably have to make animation tutorials in the future. I just want to rig and make this a separate video. So yeah, that's pretty much how you rig models, rig characters, and stuff in Roblox Studio. Hope you found this helpful. Like I said, the plugin rig edit will be in the description below to go on and just add it, download it, whatever. And uh, yeah, hope you found this helpful. Subscribe to the channel, smash the like button, and I'll see you guys in the animation tutorial. Goodbye.